The back and forth of the plastic bag ban in Albuquerque is back. Yesterday, the mayor vetoed the city council's repeal of the ordinance, but it appears we might reverse course again very soon. News 13's George Gonzalez joins us live from City Hall with an update. We had Kim the repeal on the plastic bag ban passed on a 6 to 3 vote. Now, if councilors vote again the same way, it'll be enough to override the mayor's veto. Now, the councilor who wrote the bill says he is hopeful, but things aren't looking too good. I am confident that the city councilors uh, will vote again to allow plastic bags in the city of Albuquerque. I think uh, most people realize it's the right thing to do. The ban on plastic bags took effect two years ago at the start of 2020, but due to the pandemic, it was quickly suspended. Last summer, the ban was re-implemented, but councillors last month voted to overturn it. Councillors don't think the mayor's veto will stick. I think most likely the mayor's vote, prob uh, veto probably gets overridden by the folks who wanted to repeal the bag ban in the first place. Some are optimistic that one member will change their vote to kill the override of the veto. I would hope that, that some councillors will look deep within and and maybe uh, change their vote. You know, we haven't given the, the culture a chance to, to uh, adjust to the, to the bag ban, so, and then now we're going to repeal it. It's a shame. Councilor Pat Davis, who wrote the original bill, says even if the ordinance dies, another could come back. There's always a chance that one of those votes flips. I mean, the, the votes to repeal it included Democrats and Republicans. Uh, some of them expressed that they would be willing to work on a new bill. Um, and so there's a chance that happens. Councilor Trudy Jones, who is opposing the ban, says her vote still stands. If people don't want to use plastic bags, they certainly have the right to not use plastic bags. Now, the council is expected to vote on that decision this Monday. Back to you. OK, thanks, George. Now, that decision being whether to override the mayor's veto. Councilor Davis says he will, though, start working immediately on a new possible bill.